Hey what's up guys it's S2G and welcome to my FIFA 16 player predictions video and today we're going to be predicting 5 players of Manchester City now before we start off uh, we just want to let you tell you that all the graphics in this video like the concept cards the thumbnails have been made by Flair Design so if you guys want some affordable and amazing graphics go ahead and check him out the link to his Twitter will be down in the description below apart from that let's get started the next player we're going to be talking about is Joe Hart. Now he had a good season with Manchester City and his best performance was I think against Barcelona in the round of 16 of the Champions League where he literally stopped Leo Messi, Neymar and Suarez from scoring any more goals and embarrassing City. Obviously they were actually embarrassed, you know, James Miller and all just getting nutmegged by Messi and all that. But he put in a very good performance. He saved Messi's penalty which wasn't a good penalty anyways but really he's a, just a fantastic keeper and he definitely deserves an 84 rating in my opinion and now let's move on to the next player the next player we're going to be talking about is company now he didn't have a good season with city he wasn't good in the at the back and he was he and the whole defense actually were conceding a lot of goals and well part of it is that he didn't have a good defender alongside him well Mangala wasn't good at all he was really bad I wanted to include him in this video but there were other players who deserved to be in the video but yeah I think company deserves downgrade because of his form and I think he will be an 85 rated player in FIFA 16 but obviously if he has a good season well he can he could get back to an 86 or maybe an 87 because he has that talent and he's a quality defender and now let's move on to the next player the next player we're going to be talking about is Raheem Sterling now he moved to Manchester City from Liverpool for 49 million euros and I think that fee is just ridiculous you could have bought someone like Pedro or maybe even Alexis Sanchez for that kind of money and I think he's definitely over overpriced but not overrated because he certainly got the talent and I think with players like David Silva and Sergio Aguero and even Yaya Toure around him well he could perform much better than what we all think because now we he has a that heavy price tag on him large price tag on him so it's gonna be tough for him but I think he can become a very good player in the future and I think he will get a 81 rated card next year in FIFA 16 because he was kind of good with Liverpool and apart from that let's move on to the next player. The next player we're going to be talking about is David Silva now he had a very good season with Manchester City he scored 12 goals in the Premier League and got 7 assists I think which are really good stats and he was the focal point of City's attack and you know he was the number 10 he was dictating the game not actually actually dictating it was like playmaking because dictating is I think midfielders do that but nevertheless he's a fantastic player I think he deserves a plus one upgrade and I think he will be an 88 rated player in FIFA 16 and apart from that let's move on to the final player the final player we're going to be talking about is Sergio Aguero now this guy scored 26 league goals and got eight assists in the Premier League as well he also scored a hat-trick against Bayern Munich and if this guy wouldn't get injured so often I think he could be in the top top three of the Ballon d'Or very often and maybe just maybe have a chance of winning it but that's kind of tough with players like Lionel Messi and Cristiano Ronaldo but that doesn't matter really I think he will be an 89 rated striker in FIFA 16 I think alongside Suarez he is the best he they are the best out and out strikers in the world yeah, and may maybe a few years ago you could argue that even Falca was there but now definitely not but anyways that's basically the end of this video hope you guys enjoyed it and if you guys have don't forget to leave a like subscribe for more content and I will see you guys in one of my next videos